hi I'm Kathy welcome to my channel have you ever thought about making a holiday decoration using crushed glass well that's what we're gonna do today we got a beach theme crushed glass Christmas tree and I can't wait to show you the results it's absolutely beautiful so let's get busy I'll teach you everything you need to know to make this beautiful crushed glass Christmas tree. Okay, the first thing you wanna do is prepare your frame. So I removed all these little tabs, cleaned up the frame, put some Elmer's glue all, all around the edge. I don't know why I didn't film it. Put the glass back in, put more Elmer's glue on, cleaned it up. These are the products I'm using, and let's get started. Oh yes, tape around the back, just in case you have any leakage. Also, another thing um, you can do is you can actually put water on it after your you want to set your frame aside and let it dry for 24 hours. And you can actually put water on the top to see if you have any leaks, which I didn't have any leaks, but I taped it up anyway. And now I'm putting on the crushed glass. And I did, before um, I started the video, I did lay everything out and took a picture of it just to see how I wanted it to go. And... Um, so now I'm just gonna lay down my two resin pieces, the seahorse and the dolphin, and some shells. And then I'm using um, some jewelry beads that I had. And they're just little pearls, um, white pearls and green pearls. And I had some gold metal pieces, uh, beads, and I put those in there also. And uh, I had these little shell beads, which is what I just put in there. And I put them all around also. And once I get everything placed where I want it to be, then I will start putting the resin on. All right, this is a little bag of tube confetti and I'm sprinkling that all over the tree. I'm just sprinkling it taking little amounts of my fingers and sprinkling it on the tree. And all right, here we go. Let's pour this resin. I did let the resin sit for about 15 minutes before I started. And you just wanna drizzle it over your glass. You don't wanna pour it. You just wanna drizzle it off of the stick and cover all your pieces. Once you cover your glass, then you want to make sure that your resin goes into all the corners. Just push it around, make sure it goes up into all your corners and make sure you have enough on there. Now I'm putting in the snow and I used three different things for the snow. I used those little white rocks, the little snowflakes, and the diamond dust.
So here I decided that I didn't have enough at the bottom, so I started adding a few more things at the bottom of my tree, and then I went ahead and covered those with some resin to make sure they were covered. And then you want to get down to eye level and check to make sure there's nothing in your resin. Uh, anything you want to get it out now um, and then start checking it making sure everything's covered and everything's got resin on it keep looking at it getting down and looking at it and now I'm torching it with the kitchen torch to get out the air bubbles and I will do that every 15 minutes. I come back and check it. And make sure no lint or anything has gotten in it. And making sure that, oh, that was another thing I did also, was I cleaned up all my edges and sides and anywhere I got resin on the frame, I cleaned that up now while the resin is still not cured. And then I cover it and I check it every 15 minutes, make sure there's no air bubbles. If there is, you hit it with a torch and keep it covered. Make sure you get down and see if any lints fell in it, anything flying out of the air got in it. And just keep checking it for the first couple of hours and keep it covered. And that's about it. Here it is. My finished piece. Tell me what you think down in the comments. I absolutely love this definitely going to be doing some more of these. I already have. <laughs> I didn't film them, but I did make some more. And uh, gorgeous. I love this. Love, love, love. <laughs> all right, everyone. Thanks for being here. Thank you to all my subscribers. If you're not subscribed, hey, why not? <laughs> I do all kinds of art. I love art. And I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.